Hello YouTubers, it's 1984RX7350. Well, my parts and supplies finally came today. All my tires, rims, supplies, glue. Now I can start building finally. Without the crap glue, of course. I'll show you what I got here. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten sets of rims and tires. I do have more coming still, but this is at least I can do stuff. I have 23 inch Vanquish chromes. Let's show you guys here. Get them up there. I also have the 23 inch chrome magnums. I also do have these 19 inch. These are actually the exact same set of rims that are on my truck. My real live truck. Love those rims. And I also have the 23 inch CLs by Pegasus. Like these with the spinners that or center caps to go on them. Uh, I have all my 19s which are the Chrome Diablos. Uh, the chrome tri blades I like these type I like the five like you'll find them ever like this I have some chrome wide D with tires these are deeps if I can focus in on it better I like those type I also have the chrome 19 CL which I have in the 23 inch they're like my I also have some low pros hop and hydros tires these ones are with the white wall and I have the gold D's with white walls and I also have the centers same with a comb version of those two with the centers also got in all my glues see I have testers Clear, it's a big deal, everybody knows what that is, but from clear windows. Uh, Tamara liquid cement, this is the standard, as well as the thin. Also got for wood or metal, I bought it for metal glue, if I have to glue any metal on anything. Also have some putty. Some people say it's not too good, some say it's not bad, contour putty, I'll try it. I also have tons of bond oil in the garage, so that's not a big deal. I bought this, we're going to try it out, liquid masking film. See if it's any good, if you guys want to know if it's any good, they're asking me. So we'll find out, it's worth a try. Um, let's see. Grab some more stuff here. I have some 19 inch chrome calipers, another set came in. With uh, discs, right? Uh, this is some micro brushes, 10 of them for a dollar. You know, no big deal. I did get my purple neon light in kit. It's got a switch and requires two double triple A batteries all hidden in the switch, so it's going to be the one thing hidden out and the lights underneath the bottom. Try it out. Also got the Revell or Monogram finishing product kit. It's complete sanding paper, polishing, wax, all the lovely little stuff in it. So. Also got clear PVC sheet, uh, a tinted one with like tinted windows, black gray. If I can get it to show without so bad, it's pretty flexible stuff. I also have it's still on back order uh, a blue one coming that I might use for the tinted windows and sunroofs and that kind of stuff. Just build a little frame for it. Um, not the end of the world, everybody's seen this kind of stuff. I got an odds and ends styrene package, you know. Got everything in it, you know, the basics I can show you. Quite a bit for $5.99, right? So uh, I've got point three and point four sheets. There's three sheets in each one of these. There no four sheets, five sheets in each one of these. So I got lots of that now. Um, Didn't know what sizes to get, so I bought a all piles of different tubing. I have 3.2 millimeter, um, a bigger stuff for melding frames or roll bars, 4.8 millimeter, a 1.6 millimeter or 1 16th tube, great. Right? Has some versions of little wire stuff that I might never use, but who knows. 
I have 1.16 1, 1 as well, 1 16th I mean, and 3 30 seconds tubing for hinges and all that. And also got, uh, Fast Jimmy's got one of these and we liked it and I have another guy who wants to know if it's any good. Jimmy doesn't, he says he likes it but he wants, no there's not an opinion on it. I mean I wanted this, I like it because it's two tables in one, or not in one but two separate tables so painting stand. And also another thing that came in today is my brand new factory sealed 240Z Revell kit. So, not bad. It's the same kit uh, Big uh, Big Block Love has. He built one. This is a pretty decent kit. I might not put that engine in it. I might put a 350 in it just like my real Arc 7 does, which I'm going to do to one of those too. We'll see. But at least everything came in. So now I can start building. I just got to decide which one I'm going to do first. So got more kits coming. So hopefully maybe next week a pile will show up. But thank God this stuff comes so I can actually start doing something. I said everybody's probably beginning to wonder, oh, does he actually have a build or just buy? So, <laughs> anyways, talk to you guys later. Have a Merry Christmas. If not, I'll probably talk to you guys next week because I expect some more stuff before Christmas here. So, any questions or comments, let me know. Thank you.